Go to my Instagram, DJ underscore bless one and rock out. Salute, gang. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a lot going on in these YouTube streets. Now, Asian Dog responded right back away at Julio Fulio. Now, some of y'all want to know why did she respond? I'm going to show you some of these things, but she responded at the backlash. She was facing by a lot of people. They basically let it be known she was messing around with NBA Youngboy at the time of the passing of King Von. So, during the time King Von was losing his life, Asian Doll was having fun with NBA Youngboy. I'm not saying she was sleeping with him or not. You guys can determine what was going on between both. But a lot of responses were made. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm on that good gas Zaza right now. Now, I'm going to give you guys these receipts and these clips. And you guys bear in mind a lot of these responses can somewhat be foolish responses. Now, this is what Asian Doll said. Now, if you see what Asian Dar responded to, Julio Fulio made a response which we'll go to later. Asian Dar said to Julio Fulio's previous response, which was, If something ever happened to me in life, God forbid, please don't be on that Asian Dar ish acting fake hurt. Now, she was not liking it at all she calls herself queen von now but a lot of people are mad they're like how can you call yourself queen von if von wasn't dating her we're gonna show you who actually said that as well which was kayla b von's sister now asian doll tells julio fulio when some ha do happen to you watch nobody give a f get off get off nigga dick educational purpose dope fan ass nigga but the one who looks like the fan ass nigga right now is you asian doll and before i get on asian doll's responses this is kayla b king von's sister said basically ain't no queen von because he was single which is facts i showed a receipt yesterday that showed proof he was single asian doll literally said out her mouth as well you guys broke up what's all the cap now the sister said ain't no queen von because von was single bitches was basically doing things for you know fun clout she let it be known she said bitches lied and said she was she gave von mama ten thousand. it was cap cap and lied and said she gave my niece and nephew seven thousand apiece ain't gave them ish not even a dollar fake and using his name to look good which i agree a thousand percent and it doesn't stop we read about ink the von part she called they call me messy i don't give a ish a bitch using my brother name for her own good it's not a million y'all don't know the real now whoo, king von sister be going in she said trying to make it seem like you could have a baby by him he made you get a whoo basically von made her get rid of the baby every time ho was crying she stayed lying to look good man my god they are going in they are going relentless at asian doll because asian doll seems to have a fantasy of keep using king von's name now if y'all want to know what julio fulio had said to the so-called queen asian doll let's go to it the rough rider guy wasn't having it he let his feelings speak up for himself and he responded in a fashionable way that a lot of people respected a lot of people gave him props for it this is what julio fulio said on the situation if something ever happened to me, bro, don't be an Asian dog, bro. If you know what we was on, bro, we didn't talk like that, bro. Don't be extra, bro. Like, for real, bro. Don't be on that Asian. That's like, shit this fake, bro. Y'all gotta stop that fake ass shit, man. Come on, bro. Bitch, I feel different. Little boy and my son. Real shit. If something ever happened to me, bro, don't be an Asian dog, bro. If you know what we was on, bro, we didn't talk like that, bro. Don't be extra, bro. Like, for real, bro. Don't be on that Asian. Like, shit is fake, bro. Y'all gotta stop that fake ass shit, man. Come on, bro. Now, when Fulio says this, we seen the Asian dog response. But Fulio responded again as well. Fulio clearly ain't rocking with this girl. He responded a couple of times to Asian Doll. And I'm about to show you guys those responses. Now, Asian Doll is a beautiful girl. But I think she needs to be talked about. You don't use the dead 
for clout. You don't use people just to show the world on how you living, how you feeling, because this is the wave that can help you gain that bag. If you now, if you didn't care for King Von, do as you please. But to say you care for him and you using that, it goes without saying, man. It, it looks wild to the masses. Now I'm gonna go to more receipts over here. Julio Fulio responded to her and he said kind of a lot. If you if you if you want to see what I, he said, this is his second response to Asian Doll. I don't think Asian Doll right, bro. I ain't even trying to talk about this shit. It just the circumstances like and brought off like in the couple days before he died. Now you so hurt, like how the fuck? I this why she hurt because you know she dead at wrong. That was it. You know you dead that wrong, so you so hurt. You like, damn, I'm fucking this man off. Oh, this and that, bitch. Why did you be speaking my mind, bro? And then. Stop saying niggas be clout chasing. How the fuck? I got them at 800k followers. I got clout. How the fuck niggas be clout? Julio Fulio continues to speak more about Asian Doll. I'm going to play that. I'm not going to fin. I mean, I'm not going to stop that video. Don't worry about it. I just want to show you guys receipts what's bothering people. This girl literally took everything in the name of King Von. She literally finessed her way to success by finding out that even though her and Von is not together, people would care about her more if they relentlessly show it. And I guess the showing was more important than Asian AKA Asian Brat, AKA Asian Dog, AKA Queen Vaughn. A lot of people don't like when you use the dead for clout. A lot of people can never stand behind that. And I guess Asian Dog, her herself, she wanted to impact her her music, her her wave, because a lot of people wasn't rocking with her before King Vaughn died. Now I'm gonna go back to Julio Fulio because he says a lot of great things in his response, and I'm and I'm rocking with this response. I don't be getting that you clout take that. I got fucking clout. I got fame. I'm famous, bro. I got money. I got jewelry. I got all that shit, bro. Stop playing these clout chasers. Well, I'm speaking on mine. All I'm saying is when a nigga die, or something happen to a nigga, or anything, don't be on no face shit. That's all I'm saying. Like, you're so hurt by the nigga. You know it damn well. I mean, shout out to Julio Fulio. Shout out to Asian Doll. I hope things get better. A lot of crazy situations right now. I mean, it's kind of brazy, man. I hope everything gets fixed immediately. Asian Doll got a lot of repairing she needs to do for her life right now. I don't know what she's going through, but obviously Asian Doll is not going through the most. I don't think you want to beef with a hot artist like Fulio, unless you do. I'm not talking about Fulio is going to do anything because Fulio clearly doesn't do things like that towards females. But it's just more of Asian Doll is not looking right right now. She is looking foul and I can't stand behind that. I got to let y'all know, man, this is looking wild. Salute to everybody involved in here, man. I'm your God bless one. Thank you for loving your family. Love your kids. And you know what? Stay blessed, gang. Follow me on social media, DJ underscore blessed one, and rock out with the most winningest group. Gang up in this bed.